When his dad almost fainted at the sight of the ultrasound, this nurse was shook, saying it's one in 15 million. When Bethany met Tim Webb, she knew things were different. The way he smiled, his passion for life, and lofty dreams were all something that drew Bethany to him. Thankfully, Tim felt the same way about her, and after two years of dating, he popped the question. They had no idea that their lives would be turned upside down just a few months after their wedding. Once the joyous fog of their nuptials lifted, Tim and Bethany started to talk about what the future looked like for them as a couple. Would they buy a house right away? What about pets? Would kids be a part of their plan? Bethany told CBC News that she was willing to start trying for a family right away, but Tim wanted to enjoy their time as newlyweds for a bit instead. My husband definitely wanted to wait a year. I was fine with whenever it ended up happening, but then we found out we were very excited, only thinking we were having one. Once Bethany realized that she was pregnant, they raced to the doctor and ordered an ultrasound. What happened in that doctor's office would be something that they would both remember for the rest of their lives. After positioning the ultrasound wand over her stomach at just the right angle, the tech looked at both of them and announced that they were expecting not one child, but four identical quadruplets. I could not believe it. I was in such shock. Honestly, I thought the ultrasound tech was joking. I couldn't believe it. It was a good thing that my husband was sitting down because he almost fainted. Neither Bethany nor Tim had a history of multiples in their families, and since they conceived naturally, it was even rarer. After doing a bit of research, the couple discovered that having four identical girls occurs in 1 and 13 to 70 million pregnancies. Thankfully, the rest of Bethany's pregnancy went smoothly, and they welcomed four identical twin girls named Abigail, Michaela, Grace, and Emily into the world. With four newborns to care for at home, Bethany and Tim were lucky that the community rallied around them. People from their hometown even started a fundraiser and made sure that they didn't need anything. It's really amazing because there would be no way we could do all this by ourselves. Their neighbors, family members, friends, and complete strangers did their best to make sure this overwhelmed couple was taken care of completely. Without their help, Tim and Bethany knew that things would be so much more difficult. While the thought of having four children is something that Bethany and Tim never contemplated before their daughter's birth, it's something that they're both coming to terms with now. She told CBC News, I think my husband has gotten used to the idea that there are four babies, but I don't think he's gotten used to the idea that there are four identical girls. There will be plenty of arguments, bickering, broken hearts, and blunders in the years to come, but they both know it's worth it to raise four precious girls. The web home may be chaotic for the foreseeable future, but they wouldn't have it any other way. Fortunately, the girls are growing each day and are as happy as can be.